Hey guys, welcome to Minecraft by Sonu. Today's crazy fact is about an adorable little amphibian that can regenerate its own limbs, heart, and even parts of its brain. That's right. If you were to lose your arm or leg or even part of your brain, you would probably die. But this little guy wouldn't even notice. He would just grow a new one. Let me tell you all about this amazing creature. First of all, it's known as the Mexican walking fish. But it's not actually a fish, it's an amphibian. And axolotls are native to Mexico City. They get their name from the no waddle word, axolotl, which means water monster. But don't let that fool you. These things are super cute. They have big bulging eyes, small pink mouths, and tiny little tails. And they come in a variety of colors, from black and white to brown and gold. But what really makes axolotls so special is their ability to regenerate body parts. You see, most amphibians can regenerate their limbs if they lose them to predators or injuries. And some lizards can even regrow their tails if they get bitten by a snake. But axolotls can regenerate just about anything, including their hearts and parts of their brains. In 2006, a team of researchers at the National Autonomous University of Mexico performed an experiment to see how many different body parts an axolotl could regenerate. The scientists amputated the tails of 10 axolotls and then waited to see what would happen. After four months, six of the axolotls had completely regenerated their tails. And after six months, eight of them had grown new spinal cords. But that's not all. The scientists also found that the regenerated tails were exactly the same as the original tails, both in terms of structure and function. The same thing happens when axolotls regrow their limbs. Not only do they regrow the bones, muscles, and nerves, but they also regrow the skin and scales. And it's not just the physical body that regenerates. In some cases, axolotls have even been observed to regrow their sense of smell after losing their noses. So what's the secret behind this amazing ability? Scientists are still working to figure it out. But they believe that it has something to do with the way axolotls store their DNA. Unlike most animals, axolotls don't lose their DNA when they lose a body part. Instead, their DNA remains in the cells that connect their limbs to their body. So when a salamander loses an arm, for example, its DNA is still there. Cells simply move in and start growing new tissue around it. Now, I know what you're thinking. If axolotls can regenerate their limbs, why don't we try it out? Well, it turns out that humans and other mammals do have the ability to regenerate some body parts like our skin and liver. But we lose that ability as we age. In fact, studies have shown that a young mouse can regenerate its tail, but an older mouse cannot. So it seems like regeneration is a function of age, size, and species. And while we may never be able to grow new arms or legs, just knowing that axolotls can gives us hope that one day we will be able to cure diseases that affect our ability to heal like spinal cord injuries. By studying axolotl cells, for example, scientists have been able to develop treatments for people with spinal cord injuries. Axolotls are truly amazing creatures, and we are lucky to have them on our planet. They are not only cute and friendly, but also very intelligent and adaptable. They can live in a wide range of habitats, and they are able to communicate with each other using a variety of sounds and visual cues. Axolotls are also very social animals, and they form strong bonds with their caretakers. In the wild, they live in groups of up to 10 individuals, and they spend their days looking for food and their nights sleeping with their mates. Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends and family, and subscribe to my channel.